This video is at the center of controversy in Allentown. The Lehigh County District Attorney is now investigating the circumstances leading up to it. The video surfacing led to a protest in the city this weekend and national attention from the George Floyd family lawyer. Allentown police have now responded to that video, releasing more details about what led up to the situation caught on camera. This as members of the local Black Lives Matter chapter are also weighing in. WFMC's Ali Reed is joining us live in the studio with the latest. Good morning, Ali. Good morning, Karen and Haciel. This investigation is being taken up by the Lehigh County District Attorney's Office, which includes a review of the viral video and interview with witnesses. It's following a late night protest in the city this weekend. Members of the Lehigh Valley communities started protesting in Allentown Saturday night. Hundreds demanded change after this video surfaced of an Allentown police officer was seen kneeling on a man's head outside St. Luke's Sacred Heart Hospital. We're tired and we're over it. We're over black and brown lives not mattering. Organizer Justin Parker says the protest was immediately put together after the video came to light on social media. Some saying it sparked concern of an all too familiar scene of the death of George Floyd. It's baffling to me that they don't feel like they're under a microscope as police officers after George Floyd happened. So the fact that that happened was was ridiculous. The Allentown Police Department says officers were outside the emergency room for an unrelated matter when they saw the man vomiting and staggering in the street. Police say they tried to restrain him after he started yelling, screaming and spitting at the officers and hospital staff. He was later taken into the hospital for treatment and was released. The NAACP released a statement Sunday night saying they found the incident, quote, concerning and disturbing. It went on to say they want the APD to, quote, ensure us that they are acting in a manner of integrity that shows both respect and safety for its citizens. Earlier this month, the department released a new excessive force policy, banning restraints or chokeholds unless officers are preventing imminent death or serious bodily injury to a citizen or themselves. Now people want answers and are continuing to question the incident. We're going to keep applying pressure and keep coming uh, until black and brown lives matter to Lehigh Valley because right now they don't. Now, Police Chief Glenn Granitz met with the protesters Saturday night, ensuring them the video would be investigated and updates would be provided. There is another protest scheduled tonight in Allentown, planned to start at 5 o'clock. Karen?